Yo guys, what's up? How's it going? So today we're looking at SoFi and what is SoFi stock going to do this week? That's the question. All right, so it's been kind of flip-flopping recently, although it's down from its highs of $20. A lot of reasons for that. Uh, it increased. It did have a pretty poor earnings report. I was expecting it to be better. Okay, back here, they had a good earnings report. They were almost profitable. Almost so close. And then what happened? They fell off the wagon. All right. They had some issues. They did get their banking charter. They've been really focusing on trying to get that banking charter up and running. They finally got it. Oh, wow. It's been a long time coming. So now they're an official bank. You can get checking, savings, all the official bank stuff. In addition to crypto, they can do. Uh, auto, loans, student loans, personal loans, credit cards, you name it, they got it. It's a one-stop shop for financial solution for shopping. It's it's crazy awesome. Okay, that's all I have to say. I've been using SoFi for a while. If you guys have been following my videos, um, I've been redeeming my points for free crypto. Can't beat that. All right, so every time you do something on there, they give you free points, it seems like. Go check out my other SoFi videos and be sure to subscribe, smash the like button. But you can see there's been a lot of activity. It was like nothing, 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 and bam! Lots of activity. It's like, okay, what happened right around this time frame? And it made the stock drop like crazy. Well, there was a SEC inquiry, um, some securities issues they had. Uh, so they, th I think that's all behind them now. I think that's a pat done deal. It was a one-time, one-time thing. They converted some, some uh, securities that some investors had into some other securities that they didn't tell them about or something. I don't think I was involved with that. I never got notified. I don't think it was a really huge issue. It was just that they didn't tell people it was happening. Um, so that's bad on, bad on SoFi, and that could have been what precipitated this massive, massive drop. So I do have some of this stock um, as a disclaimer, right? My cost basis is around $15. So I'm way below where I should be. But got positive indicators last week that this stock is going up. Now I'm just missing the moving average. All right. Once this moving average starts going up, it's going to be good. Now you can see we're way below the 200 day. So right here we had a death cross. That's bad for the stock. But what's good is it's recovered from this before right it's going down we had a massive if 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 they had the 200 day moving average back here we, it probably would have crossed over and it kind of recovered came back now it's going down again so i think this is a really good buying opportunity i'm going to be selling some cash cover puts in this next week i'm going to be watching this indicator very closely and uh see see what it tells me but I think we're going higher. Uh, I think we could go as high as this this ceiling here is about thirteen dollars, maybe fifteen, as high as fifteen, but probably not any higher than that right now until we get some really good news and we can push through that two hundred day moving average and that ceiling. So tell me what you guys think of SoFi. Go check them out. Really good online bank. I like them a lot. Be sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching.